I am Lauren, I'm the editor of The Peak, and today I'm with our Future Proof Edition cover personality. Hi, I'm Frank. I'm the CEO and founder of Sunseed. We strive to produce clean energy affordably for everyone. As the founder of a green energy solutions company, be honest, how green are you in real life? We have a EV for the past seven years. I, I moved into this place about two years ago. So uh, we recently converted into uh, a Tesla. So for the EV, for the past seven years, we have not pumped a drop of petrol. Right? So that's pretty green if you ask me. Uh, I've installed solar panels on my rooftop here. Uh, my bills used to be uh, around $700, now it reduced sub $300. Uh, I, I think uh, it's a very interesting phenomenon because I start to start charging cars around noon time because we have the excess power that is produced during noon and we use that to charge the car. What does the term future-proofed mean to you personally? Mm. I think future proof to me is about getting ready and being prepared for what is to come. I mean, of course, in my industry, it's like we know climate change is coming. So what are we doing as a business to address it? Uh, and, and that's exactly what Sunseed is about. Yeah. So uh, we are addressing climate change through the energy energy transition, right? Trying to reduce our carbon footprint um, and have a zero carbon power landscape in 2050 in Singapore. I think this must be so important to you, especially because you're a parent. You know, most parents want to leave a better uh, climate, a better planet to their kids. Yeah, for sure. Um, in fact, uh, I always ask my son, you know, uh, uh, you, what do you think daddy do? And he'll say, you have a superpower, you are using the son's power. And then I ask him, what, what does he do? You know, because I want to ask. Interestingly, he, he, he told me that I, I have the moon's power. First, I thought he was joking, of course, but I came to think about it is, yeah, and actually harnessing the lunar, which is the waves and the tidal for energy is probably the next milestone we can look forward to. What is a global issue that you think must be tackled right now? I think food security is a main issue. Alright, especially if you, I mean, we are feeling the pinch of the Ukraine war currently. Energy prices is an all-time high because of a shortage of gas supply. But I think what will come next is the shortage of food supply. Ma majority of the fertilizers right, uh, comes from Russia. So with the sanctions around, I, I think uh, there will be a uh, soon food shortage around the world. And how to address this is, is part of my personal interest as well because I have another part of the family business that is doing vertical farming. So uh, getting involved in you know, a farming Leafy greens, you know, ensuring the 30 30 supply for Singapore. That's another part of my personal mission statement. Yeah. Last question What do you want your legacy to be? I hope to create an ASEAN green grid by connecting Indonesia all the way to China uh, and have a green grid which creates clean energy for 